Hey everybody, welcome back to MTG Spec. Today we are doing a box opening, unboxing of uh, Bunsen Beaver 2, the long awaited double pin redemption comic from Bad Idea. Isn't it ironic too that one of the few pins I have is from the other button redemption werewolf? Anyway, so we're going to take a look at Bunsen Beaver 2. Uh, they packed this pretty well. Let's see. Where's the, uh, you know, we can probably just cut a big old gaping hole in the side. Hopefully it hasn't settled down too too far. I don't boy, they take the hell out of it, so we're just gonna try our best here. Alright. Hey. Oh, that's interesting. I forgot they were sending it in uh one of those boxes. I never got the first Bunsen Beaver. So I haven't read the story. <laughs> Nobody cares about the story, but uh, but yeah, I did not have uh, a chance to go to South Carolina just to buy a donut for the first one. All right, nothing. No no rocks or bowling pins or anything like that in the box. Just this stuff. So it looks like we have a bad idea letter with their patented. Ah, sorry. Snarky uh, silliness. Let's take a look. Let's see what they say. Well, they don't say much. Uh, they say, bad idea, Bunsen Beaver. Wow. Bad idea orders. All right, so nothing much to it. Just that there's a thingy. Well, that is a cool looking box. Look at it go. It's, uh, certified by bad idea donut. All right, well. Let's dig a little deeper. We gotta see the book after all this time. So we are coming up on, I believe, about one year since they offered this redemption for Bad Idea. Uh, sorry, for Bunsen Beaver Two. Um, so this is quite, quite a long time coming. All right. Well, there it is. Open her up. Ooh -wee. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Okay. Nice. Well padded. All right. We're getting closer. Of course, we'll be taking nice care of that box. That's a very cool. I do like the box. All right. Well, they they took they took this one more seriously than the other one. I think. Um, the condition was not terrific on. Uh, the other pin redemptions they, they sent out, uh, Werewolf and Retirement Plan. And notably, uh, Werewolf had, I think, what was it, like 168 copies made, and Retirement Plan had only uh, 148, something like that. I don't remember the exact numbers, but let's say 168, 148, roughly. Um, well, they sent a nice little top loader. We give you one donut. Ooh. There's a redemption. I like the, uh, I believe that's a, uh, Punisher, um, cover swipe. Uh, but this looks like it's in pretty nice shape. I've never actually had a top loader for a comic before. All right, let's get, let's see what this is all about. We owe you one donut. <laughs> okay, so they owe us a donut. All right, well, no doubt this is redeemable for a donut at some point, at somewhere. Um... All right, well, there we go. Bunsen Beaver 2. Shall we look more closely inside? I say, why not? We're only going to do one opening video for this. And you know what? This thing's rare enough where I'm just going to take that piece of tape right off so we don't catch it. Because uh, if, if single pin redemption books were limited to, like, what, 148, 168, like I said, ooh, this one actually has nice cardstock, very glossy. But I can only imagine that uh, this one has a even lower print run. Lovely back cover. Um, I'm, I'm assuming this has a sub 100 print run, uh, which moves it from the category of rare to scarce. Uh, we're going to flip through a little bit, see what's going on. Looks like, is this, wow. Pretty cool art. I don't know what's going on? 
what is this? Oh, oh, of course, Bad Idea always has funny things in the Indicia. Let's see what this says, anything. Um, oh my god. Did you, uh, did you know that a photo of the Office star BJ Novak was accidentally uploaded to a public domain stock image website and has since been used to promote products all around the world? I am too amused to do anything about it, wrote Novak on an Instagram story. He has since modeled for Chinese hair clippers, Swedish cologne, Uruguayan face paint, and even English knee-length rain ponchos. Naturally, we added American comics to the list. Bad Idea is hashtag blessed to announce that the office star BJ Novak is now the face of Bad Idea Labs. And yes, that means Bad Idea Donuts presents Bunsen Beaver and his pal tree one. It's the first appearance of BJ Novak in comics. All right. Well, I there it is. If you want to freeze frame, read it for yourself. Um, this art's pretty good. Is this uh, is this one has a rip? Who did this? I actually don't know anything about the creative team, um, but looks like we have a little bit of a, a Reservoir Dogs ish thing going on. I like this art. The pa the paper quality is very nice. Very nice indeed. I'll, God willing, I'll get this graded someday. Uh, yeah, this has got to be Juan Jose Rip. Oh my God. And then what is... Okay, so is the B-side the original Bunsen Beaver? I don't know. I, well, they already reprinted Bunsen Beaver in... Um, I think they reprinted it in one of the... Oh boy. It's a B-side about grading. Speak of the devil and the devil shall surely appear. Um, all right. These pages, man, this card quality is, or the paper quality is very nice. Okay, okay here we go. This is kind of the goodies here. All right. Uh, yeah, one Jose Rip. All right. And then the further adventures of Tree. Okay, so this is also a new one. David Lapham art. Robert Venditti writing them both. All right, well, there it is. Please stand by. Um, this may be the last Bad Idea comic I get. It's certainly the rarest. Uh, I have no doubt about that because I don't have a Hero Trade. And even if I did, I suspect this one is more rare than Hero Trade. Anyway, um, I'll see uh, Dinesh Samdasani. I'll see you for my free donut at some point. Um, if you can provide a vegan donut. Anyway, okay, bye.